Hey learners, struggling with tricky exam questions? I have got you. This is Learning is Fun, where we solve critical thinking puzzles one topic at a time and even tackle real exam questions at the end. Let's make learning fun and easy. Let's start. What can living things do? A breathe. B. Grow. C. Excrete waste. D. All of these. D. All of these. Mark has a toy robot. The robot moves when he presses a button, but it doesn't grow, eat, or breathe. Is the toy robot a living or non-living thing? And why? A. The robot is living because it moves. B. The robot is non-living because it doesn't grow, eat, or breathe. C. The robot is living because it can be turned on. D. The robot is non-living because it moves. B. The robot is non-living because it doesn't grow, eat, or breathe. Tom is walking in the park. He sees a dog running, a tree standing still, a rock on the ground, and a car parked near the path. Which of these are living things? A. The dog and the rock. B. The tree and the car. C. The dog and the car. D. The dog and the tree. D. The dog and the tree. Seema sees a plant in her room, a toy robot, a bird singing outside, and a pencil. Which of these can grow and reproduce? A plant. B. Bird. C. Plant and bird. D. Toy robot. C. Plant and bird. Max was playing with a ball outside. He threw the ball, and it rolled away. Then, Max noticed the ball stopped moving after it hit a tree. What can you conclude about the ball? A. The ball is a living thing because it moved. B. The ball can walk and talk. C. The ball is a non-living thing because it does not grow or change by itself. D. The ball is alive and can breathe. C. The ball is a non-living thing because it does not grow or change by itself. You have a car that helps your family go places. It needs fuel to run, but it doesn't move on its own unless someone drives it. Is the car living or non-living? Explain why. A living, because it moves with fuel. B non-living, because it doesn't grow or change on its own. C living, because it moves from one place to another when we drive. D non-living, because it moves. B non-living, because it doesn't grow or change on its own. There is a tree in your yard. It grows leaves and flowers, but it doesn't seem to excrete any waste like animals do. So is it a living thing? A living, because it grows and produces oxygen. B, non-living, because it doesn't move. C, living, because it does not excrete waste. D, non-living, because it doesn't excrete waste. A living, because it grows and produces oxygen. Which of these is a characteristic of living things? A can grow. B cannot breathe. C cannot reproduce. D made of rocks. A can grow. How do plants breathe? A through their roots. B through their flowers, C through the stomata on their leaves, D through their branches. C through the stomata on their leaves. Insects breathe through, A air holes, B stomata, C gills, D head. A air holes. Sarah noticed that the leaves on her indoor plant were turning yellow and wilting. 
Even though she watered it regularly, she realized the room had very poor air circulation and little sunlight. What part of the plant might be struggling to function properly in these conditions, affecting its ability to support new life? A roots, because they absorb water. B stem, because it holds the plant upright. C stomata, because they need air and light to exchange gases. D flowers, because they produce seeds. C stomata, because they need air and light to exchange gases. A farmer plants tomato seeds every year and gets new plants from them. What characteristic of living things is shown by this cycle? A growth. B. Movement. C. Reproduction. D. Excretion. C. Reproduction. When Mira touched a mimosa, touch me not, plant its leaves closed immediately. What characteristic of living things does this show? A. Uh, they breathe. B. They move. C. They reproduce. D. They grow. B. They move. How do insects sense changes in their surroundings? Wings, mouth, antennae, legs. Antennae. Which characteristics of living thing is shown in this picture? A. Living things grow. B. Living things breathe. C. Living things reproduce. D. Living things excrete waste. A. Living things grow. A student sees a cloud moving in the sky. She says the cloud is alive because it moves. What is wrong with her reasoning? A. Uh, only birds can move in the sky. B. Clouds are made of cotton. C. Moving alone doesn't make something alive. D. Clouds eat air. C. Moving alone doesn't make something alive. Let's review past acid exam question on the topic living and non-living things. Here is the question. What is common among the living things shown below? A. They need water. B. They live on land. C. They make their own food. D. They can move from one place to another. Let's check each option one by one. Let's start from option D. They can move from one place to another. All living things shows movement but plants cannot move from one place to another. They show movement in their body parts. Option C. They make their own food. Tigers don't make their own food. Option B. They live on land. Lotus are aquatic plants. Option A. They need water. Yes, correct option is option A. All living things need water. I hope this question helped you level up your prep. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe for more brain boosters. See you soon.